Hello everyone, welcome to the Smart Post Show Pro Plugin video tutorial series. Today I'm going to show you how to create and customize a post to grid layout. Make sure that Smart Post Show Pro Plugin is installed and activated into your site. You can directly click on Add New or you can click Manage Shows and then click Add New to create a new show and give it a title. Below that you'll find the option to select a layout from 8 different layout presets. I am selecting grid as this is the topic of this video. Click show preview and you can see this is how a grid layout display initially. You can create a grid layout to different post types like media, post, pages, products and multiple post types. Select post types as product and update the preview. And you can see now the grid layout is showing with the products. Let's get back to the post types. As you are creating a grid layout, you may look forward to the pagination options. Go to the display options configuration tab and scroll down to the pagination related properties at the bottom of the page. Here you can enable or disable the pagination. Select pagination type from four different options like load more button Ajax, Ajax number pagination, infinite scroll Ajax, no Ajax, normal pagination. Before explaining the pagination types, let's publish the shortcode and go to a page where you want to display it. Insert the shortcode using the Smart Post Show Pro Guten Bar block. Select the shortcode and you will get a preview of it. Publish the page and view it. This is how you can showcase your post in a grid layout in your web pages. Now go back to the pagination features. Pagination type is selected as load more button Ajax. Go to the page and you can see this is the load more button Ajax pagination. Click on the button to show more post like this. It will show you a message like no more post available. Next one is Ajax number pagination. Select it, update the shortcode, refresh the page. So this is how Ajax number pagination looks like. Click on the second pagination to load more post. This is how the Ajax number pagination works. If you had more post, then the pagination will show like one, two, three, dot, dot, dot. Next pagination type is infinite scroll. Select it. Update the shortcode and refresh the page. On this pagination, more post load on page scroll. The last one is no Ajax normal pagination. Select it, update the shortcode and refresh the page. You can see this is how the normal pagination works. If I click on 2, then it will load more post on the second pagination. Let's go back to the 1. Then you can see the first pagination post are showing. Now if I go to the second pagination then it will show the second pagination post. You can set the pagination separately for mobile devices. Here is the option to set pagination separately for mobile devices. Customize the load more button level, ending message, pagination color, alignment, items per page from here. Items per page means how many posts you want to show per pagination. By default the value is set to 12. Go to the page. And you can see if I go to the first pagination, then 12 posts will show in the first pagination. Basically, it will show 12 posts on each pagination, but make sure that you have enough posts to load. Since I have only 20 posts, that is why it is showing less than 12 posts in the second pagination. But on the first pagination, it is showing 12 posts. If I change the value to 8, Update the shortcode, refresh the page, then you can see 8 posts are showing on each pagination. If I click on second pagination, then you can see more 8 posts loaded. And if I go to the third pagination, then only 4 posts load because I don't have enough posts to load. At the top of the display options configuration tab, you will get an option named grid style. You can select a grid style from event or machinery. Use the content orientation features to give your grid layout an elegant look. Let's customize the grid layout a bit. Ok, the customization has done. Now update the shortcode and refresh the page. Go to the first pagination. You can see how beautifully the grid layout is showing now. If you want, you can change the text related properties, font family, font style, color and etc. Let's hide the meta fields from the grid layout. Update the shortcode and refresh the page. Now you can see how beautifully the post grid is showing. Suppose you want to add an Ajax Live filter button at the top of the grid layout. You can do that easily with the Smart Post Show Pro plugin. 
go to the filter content configuration tab and scroll down to the advanced filtering section check taxonomy and select a taxonomy from category post tag and post format i am selecting category then choose taxonomy terms or leave this field empty to display all the taxonomy terms in the live filter i am leaving this field empty below that you will find the option to add ajax live filter check the box and update the shortcode refresh the page you can see this is how the ajax live filter buttons are showing above the grid load those are the ajax live filter buttons click on the buttons to filter post also you can customize the ajax live filter buttons those are the options to customize the ajax live filter buttons I have already explained about the Ajax Live Filter buttons in another video. Please watch this video to get a better idea about it. There are so many options to customize your post showcase and acquire your desired goal. I have shown you only a few core features. Check the plugin documentations and demo videos to get more ideas. That's all about creating and customizing the post grid layout. In the next video, I will come up with another attractive feature of the plugin. Until then, take care.